Well, Joanne, we saw that video just moments ago, and it shows that suspect pacing outside of the Sitco gas station before he sees the victim. And police say this is their biggest tool in trying to solve this case. For hours early Thursday morning, Detroit police gathered evidence at a Sitco gas station where a young man in his 20s was shot and killed on the city's east side. The man had just gotten off work and rode his bike to the station at the corner of Chalmers and Houston Whittier for what should have been a quick stop. While he was at the gas station, our suspect approached and some type of altercation ensued, uh, at which point a weapon was produced and uh, the suspect did shoot. Detectives marked more than half a dozen shell casings outside the victim's overturned bike. The victim was rushed to St. John Hospital where he was pronounced dead. Police say the suspect is a black man in his 20s, about 5 foot 10 with a goatee, wearing a dark colored jacket. He took off southbound on Houston Whittier in a newer model white pickup truck. And police are hoping someone out there will recognize him from this surveillance video. It's obviously that partnership with our community that helps us close these cases. It's unclear whether the victim knew the shooter and what kind of relationship they had. And while this may not have been a random crime, police are reminding people to always be vigilant. When you are anywhere, I don't care if you're in the city of Detroit, in the suburbs, you should always be mindful of your surroundings that late at night. Be mindful of what's going on around you. Be mindful of the activity and the people that are around you. The victim has been identified, but police are not releasing his name at this time. Anyone who may recognize the suspect in that video is asked to contact Detroit Police or Crime Stoppers. We're live outside Detroit Police Headquarters, Jane Park, 7 Action News.